Hello everybody, I'm Jimmy Fantastic and this is my World Cup 2018 video. So yes, there is there is another World Cup this year which is pretty cool. And there's $30,000 worth of prizes which is also pretty outstanding. So let's get into it. There are three ways to qualify for the World Cup 2018 playoffs. Champs Ladder, Community Leagues and the Invitational Cup. Uh, I'll link that in the description there for the World Cup official website. Uh, the Champs Ladder Season 14 and 15, um, you can qualify on Xbox or PS4 as well as PC slash Mac. Uh, the semi-finalists on PC qualify, so four, uh, um, and the winner of the PS4 and the winner of the Xbox One. Um, season 14 runs from April the 4th to May the 9th, and Season 15 runs from May the 9th till June the 13th. Um, so there'll be a total of 12 coaches from the Champs Ladder qualify for the playoffs. So the vast majority of qualifiers will actually be coming from the uh, community leagues. A total of 50 tickets given out by these. And uh, I think most of the sign-ups have stopped for these. But as you can see, there's, there's quite a few different leagues with various amounts of tickets. Even some for the PS4 and Xbox. So, um, yeah, that, that's, that's pretty cool. I think it's a good way of doing it. Uh, Rebel's the biggest one there with four tickets, um, and yeah, mo as I say, most of them have started. So this isn't this isn't such a viable uh, route for people who are watching this video, maybe. But there you go. And the final way to qualify is through the Invitational Cup, which uh, Cyanide are running with uh, eight coaches invited, five from Champs Ladder PC, two from Champs Ladder PS4, and one from Champs Ladder Xbox One. Um, they've they've thought of this qualifying criteria and uh, yeah so t two out of eight there is pretty good odds isn't it the, the, the finalists will both uh, will both qualify for the World Cup 2018 playoffs so so there you go that's the final breakdown you've got 50 from private leagues 12 from champs ladder and two from the Invitational Cup for a total of 64 players coaches whatever you want to call them in the playoffs so the actual playoffs will take place from July the 16th till August the 16th, a 64-man single elimination, best of one knockout. Um, and the rules they've got is actually pretty cool. They're using the new resurrection feature, so uh, there will be custom teams and there will be no, uh, no deaths or anything. They won't carry on and there won't be star player points. However, they've got this system whereby um, after you play the games, you will, uh, you'll be able to add more and more skills. Um, so the tier one teams, only four single skills. So the tier two getting an additional single and a double skill makes them quite a bit more powerful. And you get to stack up to two skills on each player. Um, so yeah, an extra 50. That's actually quite a big gap. That's bigger than it usually is from tier one to tier two in NAF style tournaments. Uh, I don't think anyone will be using the tier three ones. <laughs> but, you know, it's interesting as they add these extra doubles and normals, the, the, so the disparity between Tier 1 and Tier 2 will be greater in the first round, but eventually you'd expect the Tier 1 teams to close the gap and uh, you know it'll be less of a difference in the final. Um, so yeah, I think it's a pretty cool format. It opens up some kind of like, you know, block, claw, mighty blow, that kind of thing. Claw, mighty blow piling on becomes an, op an option for some teams. And also, you know, blodge step and... Tackle mighty blow and all this kind of stuff. So there's, uh, the, I think it's a pretty, pretty interesting format. So I'm looking forward to see what teams people make and stuff, and that should be very good. So as far as the prizes go, the winner will get three thousand dollars and an Asus pack worth about six thousand seven hundred. Very nice. Runner up fifteen hundred, four thousand three hundred pack. Third and fourth get a thousand dollars, and the pack worth six seventy. 5th to 8th get 500, 9th to 16th 250, and everyone who qualifies gets this stuff. And uh, you may think that's silly getting Blood Bowl 2 Legendary Edition, but of course you need Legendary Edition to uh, make a custom team, and also people who might qualify from PS4 and Xbox, so it's not silly that you get Blood Bowl 2 for, for qualifying for the World Cup. Um, so yeah, that's, that's pretty much all of the information about the World Cup. So I'll show you now the teams that I'm using in my qualifiers. So I only entered three World Cup qualifiers just because I figured that the easiest way to qualify would be through the Champs Ladder playoffs, giving roughly four tickets for 32 players, as opposed to the private leagues, which are about one ticket per 30 players. 
Um, the Rebel had a bit of a strange twist on the normal NAF, but I went to as close to a normal Wood Elf team as I could. Tackle, strip, dodge, wrestle, leader, pretty standard. Three man, two rerolls. Um, so that's the Rebel one. The Deutsch Blood Bowl community is nearly exact, nearly identical. Tackle, strip on the dancers, leader, thrower, two dodge guys, two rerolls, treat. Um, and then the AD English qualifier, AD English Invitational qualifier, um, his is not res. Those two are both res, so you know, custom teams, skill package, no injuries. This is just normal normal progression. So I went with Undead just for the you know the sheer power out of the gate with the three ghouls, with two mighty blow guys, and because it's only well, it's actually ten rounds. This is, but the the other teams won't like catch up. To, you know, Necro etc won't catch up to the power level of of Undead. I don't think. So um, what I'll do is I shall put all of these three teams. I'll be uploading them all to YouTube so you can follow. You can follow my efforts to qualify with those, and uh, yeah, I've already started on Champs Ladder, so um, not the best record actually so far with this team, 6-1-2, um, but you know, they're getting there, and I will, I will definitely be trying to qualify through the Champs Ladder, uh, I'll be grinding a lot of games and I'll be uploading all those to YouTube, so um, thanks for watching, if you enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.